Oh yeah, lightning bliss. I have a neat little tactic for you. Mm. Whenever you find yourself getting frustrated at Tetris, just think to yourself how much worse it would be if it was 3D Tetris and it should counteract the Reese. Oh my god, no, that'll make it worse. It would definitely make it worse. It would. I would have a stomach ache just watching that. Ugh. Meow? I meow. heard a cat meow. I actually wasn't paying attention. I'm sorry. Can you I say that again? I think it's <laughs> my cat. I don't know. What the fuck? <laughs> Logic, what did you say to her, to Blissy earlier? She wasn't paying attention. Oh, I said whenever you find yourself getting frustrated at Tetris, just think of how much worse it would be if it was 3D Tetris and it should counteract the reason. <sighs> Why would I do that? <laughs> because, because, Why because, would I want to increase no, my out. insanity? Give me out. It's like it gives well, you... it would help you fit in with the rest of us better. No, I. Well, to be fair, I lost no, my sanity no. back when I was ten, but still. <laughs> no, but it's like, no, but it's like you're giving yourself a mental image of something that's definitely ten times worse than what you are doing. So it's like, yeah, my life's not so bad. It's like the John Tron theory. It's like, oh, I just got stabbed with a sword, but hey, that guy just got stabbed with two swords. Oh my god. I don't think that's how that works. I don't think that's how that works either. <laughs> well, I mean, like, yeah, getting stabbed with a sword is bad, but, you know, if I had to make the decision, I'd rather get stabbed by only one. Ah. Ah, dooba. But then again, everyone, everyone is different. The cat wants attention. Scoop it up. So, how do you, so, so, chat, mm -hmm. how do you guys feel about donation oh. bots? Uh, what? I said, yes, how do you guys... Chat about the donation. Yeah, no, I mean donation goals. Oh, yeah. Uh... <laughs> hmm. So, um, quest. Answer, Blissey. Hmm? I'm not, what? Not oh, Blissey! <laughs> me! Yes! Oh, oh my god! I'm like, I'm Wait, really who scared. said that? I, I wasn't even looking at the thing. Jesse vlog. I'm sorry, I'm sorry Jess. They, you... there's too many, I'm sorry, it's just that with, there's too many voices and... You, yeah, you kind of have a similar voice. You kind of have a similar voice. I get that a lot. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. Like. You know, this is the kind of thing. not sound alike. What is wrong with you? This okay, is the kind I'm of shit that anyway. I get with me and Solar. <laughs> I, I just want to say, say that Jesse and. Oh, go on. Go on, let Logic say something first. Okay. Yeah. It's like. I can, I can kind of hear it, and I can definitely say that Jesse and Blissey definitely sound more alike than Golden and Sola ever did. So yeah. Oh. Oh, what's it like it's more Texan, isn't it? No, 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 no. It's, but I'm not saying you both sound exactly alike. I'm just saying that I can get why people would think that. Because I can tell you both apart. At least you can! At any rate, what were you wanting to ask? It was related to, uh, uh to something Zelda related. Okay. You know, you know how many people get so much hourglass and it slowly became like one of the underrated games? Would you agree it's considered under- No, I hate Phantom Hourglass. Are you serious? I'm you dead. Too? I'm dead serious. I couldn't finish that one. It, ugh. I understand why people got so frustrated over the game. It's mainly because it's- they were- we're trying something new with the DX. So no, it's not that. That's not it. it, it okay, it, I. Ugh, I don't like that fan, that hour. Was it because it's of the, the ocean? Oh. It's the temple of the ocean. King. Oh, it was the ocean king dungeon. Yes, 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 yes. That's another one that was considered a hated one. I can understand that. Luckily, they fixed that for the spirit track. I haven't had a chance to play. Spirit Tracks. Oh, right. Spirit Tracks, they fixed a few things that they did from Phantom Hourglass, like that dungeon in particular. Since you had to go back just one particular tower over and over, they luckily fixed it to where you don't have to do like the same thing with the Temple of the Ocean. Oh, that's... Plus, plus not being on a timer until your health's draining probably helps. 
Oh yeah, they don't do that. They don't really do that in the game. Instead, um, this is your method of defense because Princess Zelda turns into a spirit uh, in this. Yeah, game. I know. I, I know the general gist of spirit uh, of spirit tracks I just played. Yeah, oh, the, well, uh, and I'm not. I'm not a fan of the fact that it is a. It kind of does away with. It does away with the open world a bit. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. I mean, I don't mind it as much like like a lot of people complain about. I don't really mind it. I think it's not my. It's not something that bothers me as much. <laughs> but um. Did, did you seriously just get the extra heart? Jump right into the ocean. <laughs> yeah, I actually did that. I have a feeling Whoopsie. the Phantom Hourglass has a similar uh, thing of what uh, uh, Majora's Mask did. I don't know. I could be Whoopsie. wrong. I'm actually going to head out now, guys. I'll see you later. I'm not going to... I'm probably not going to hang around for too much longer because I'll have to get set up for my... <sighs> okay. But I'm not leaving yet. Don't worry. Okay. Okay. Um, also, what was what was your stream going to be again? Um, I'm working on craft for for my fairy craft store. Okay. It's basically just doing 3D artwork. Ooh. And she calls her show Minecraft. Yay! Minecraft. How about no? I get to <laughs> see. I get. No? I get to see Ellie's art streams again because they were like my favorite thing in the world at one point. Oh. Oh god. I don't know. Golden probably never heard what happened in this one time when I was on Ellie's stream. Ellie probably won't remember. Uh -huh. But, uh, way back, a while back on one of your recent streams, when I don't know who it was, but somebody was making horrible toilet humor jokes. What? Oh my god. What? And I decided to jump at the bag of it only once and made a horrible pun with it. <laughs> and she got at me for it. I don't remember this. Yeah, it was it was something I don't remember the whole ordeal, but then I made a pun involving diarrhea. Oh my god. Uh -huh. <laughs> and then and I made it I made it point out, don't go diarrhea on us. Uh, oh my god. Okay. And then Ellie's like, Jesse, not you too! <laughs> So now I now I think I know why Ellie doesn't remember this. <laughs> she didn't want to remember it. Repression, repression is a beautiful, beautiful thing. <laughs> <laughs> I was laughing so hard when I got when I managed to get her worked up. I was like, I heard. <laughs> God fucking damn it! Like from what I like, from what I remember, all I ever did in Ellie's streams was. Like, like post some cool art stuff and comment on the cool art stuff and talk about cool art stuff. <gasps> Fun times. I remember. <laughs> Notice me, Sandra. <laughs> also, yes, the reason I is like the reason I called Ellie my art senpai at that one part in the stream is because I love Ellie's art streams. <laughs> they were inspiring. <laughs> they inspired me to make what I am making currently. Which is cool. I inspired someone. In fact, I'll, like, That's I'll, post, I'll post some of the stuff I made recently in the stream so you can take it in and enjoy. Hold on. Someone did an Espeon thing. <laughs> Espeon? And I guess Espeon. Espeon's cool. Uh, Aubreon's my number one. Uh, 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 I get stuck between Umbreon and Sylveon. I like Edie. <laughs> the only stream that I remember from Eliora is the Dark Cloud 2 streams. When the, um, when the Sphita became a thing, that's so... Fucking soul. Oh, come on. <laughs> what happened, man? I got the wrong card. Yeah, I put I posted those things in the stream chat for anyone who wants to take a look at the fruits of my 
Him ah, getting him AIDS. Uh, uh, where'd you put it? The stream mm. chat. Oh, those are cute! Yeah. <laughs> I like the Naga. Hey. It's based off, uh, well, the Centaur and the Naga, or like Lamia as my friends called her, were um, based on like Monster Masume because they were made for a friend of mine. Or ah. Made, like, okay, this is going to be a really complicated retelling of why no. I made these, oh. but there's a okay. friend of mine. There's a friend of mine who really likes Monster Musume, and I mean really, really likes Monster Musume. And I just decided yeah. I was going to make a character based on him, because all the characters I make are in some way based on okay. Apart from these two. Because these two I made specifically because his character was, you know, into demi-humans. <laughs> they're, they're really cute. Yeah, thank you. Like, at one point, I had this idea where, like, I recreate some, like, already existing characters in my art style. Like, the Brony D&D &D character. Eee! Fair Theron appreciates your, uh, your fandom. Yee. <laughs> and it won't be too hard, because you already have the images of most of the D&D &D characters, so I at least know what Oh, and it's to so be. hard to draw. Oh, my God. His proportions are so fucking weird. Sorry about the silence. Just, okay. How dare you? That's fine. I had a I had to tend to my daughter. Mm -hmm. I had to tend to my <laughs> daughter. She needed my help. Hi, how baby. Dare you... So, so the how dare you is now rescinded. <laughs> when how a, when dare you? When the mother's job is never done. <laughs> So, ever. <laughs> well, sometimes I'll have my, my moments to my. <gasps> yeah, but you're still a mother. That doesn't stop happening. <laughs> no, no, that's true. You get five seconds. It's like the child doesn't <laughs> stop existing when you exit the room. <laughs> well, the funny thing, okay. She responds. <laughs> she um, she's gonna do her first sleepover with at my sister's house tomorrow she's gonna do her first official sleepover oh and like yay noticed? she's been looking me her and my sister have been looking forward to doing this together for so long and i was like yay <laughs> she's gonna have so much fun with me. because my sister just loves her <laughs> pieces i mean it's uh, no i'm not surprised but at the same time like holy cow holy cow i'm surprised she's, people fall in love with her so fast <laughs> So, referring to earlier, um, hang on, let me see if I can try hey. to get this right. <clears throat> Damn it! It always lands on the fucking mushroom. Hello? Why? Oh, um, <laughs> um, yeah, someone in the, um, stream chat been staking you for bliss again. <sighs> ah! What was Ishmael's argument? Anyway. Oh, Desert Samurai, please stop calling me bliss. I am not bliss. <laughs> Arjun, I said it's Jeff. Call me I told Lucky. You. I go by the the character Lucky. It's like for Lucky the people, genre, yeah. it's like for the people who can't tell. Do you the have, difference, have I... a horse? Do you have horseshoes, Pata? Oh God. No, I'm. Like... Damn it! I thought ah. it was funny. Earrings. <laughs> <laughs> I got it. I got it. I like earrings. You got uh, nice oh, blue. Oh. You got <laughs> nice chest. I just saw what got. I I just saw the miss. I just saw the level you were on gold. Yeah. That made me so sad. This is so sad. <laughs> so as far as, um, as far as other games are concerned, at some point, and some of you would be excited for this, I'm going to stream a Pokemon game. Pokemon Man! Oh, yep. oh, if you're doing... Pokemon. Oh, please, if I'm you're doing a Pokemon Gen game, please do Mystery waiting Dungeon. For the announcement. You guys are all talking over each other. I didn't understand a damn word. I said, if you're doing a Pokemon game, please do I Mystery know. my favorite thing. If they're all fire types, how am I going to confront with Black water? Pokemon 
Pokemon Mystery Dun like Pokemon Mystery Dungeons Explorers of Sky was like my favorite thing. And it was the first Me Cry, fun fact. If you no matter what Pokemon game you do, you have to make sure to Good luck with that. Keyframe said that she's going to start a Pokemon <laughs> campaign where her entire team consists of Caterpies, and she refuses to evolve them. Oh my god, why? <laughs> why? Oh, That's horrible. I have a team of Magikarps. No! Master Carp, <laughs> right with Magikarps. I have an idea for it. You know, if, if you do... He's like... Be the biggest fucking Pokemon <laughs> troll. Well, no, at the end of the day, then, <laughs> Less. Yeah, yeah Golden, should, uh, Golden should do a Pokemon game and do the Nuzlocke challenge, where whenever you, whenever one of your Pokemon faints in battle, you have to store that Pokemon and then never use them again for the entire playthrough. Well, that, that will be hard to set up. Hey, I, <laughs> hey, I said, I, hold on, I, I said nothing. I think a team may completely... I didn't completely... say anything. I didn't I think... say anything either. I, I will it's... very loudly and proudly roll my eyes at you. <laughs> Ellie says that she'll roll, or proudly roll her eyes at you. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? I'm a Pokemon elitist, damn it! Uh, That's why I was... No. I hear child. That's, That's my daughter. <laughs> I I hear cute. Yeah, some of that happened. By the way, they're all saying hello. That's my daughter. My soul can't take it. So, um, Jeez. so are 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 any of you guys open to donation goals? Oh. The next time I stream. She's giving you guys hugs! Oh. So golden. Oh my oh. gosh. So golden, you talk about donations? Yep. But anyways, as I was saying... E. Yeah, so donation goals. Uh, anybody got any ideas? Uh, yeah, uh, uh, you did mention Pokemon. Well, Pokemon's an idea that I want to do at some point. Pokemon okay, one of you, okay, one of your donation world. goals mm -hmm. is like, I have a pretty idea. One... Oh. Donation goal, donation goal. Go ahead, Logic. Mm. Right. One of your donation goals should be, like, if they reach a certain amount, you do the um, Pokemon Nuzlocke challenge. And basically what that is, is... Oh, God, no. What the fuck is the Nuzlocke just... challenge? No, 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 no. Don't do that. Don't do that. It's yeah, basically, it's... It, 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 and basically... especially don't do it for someone who's not used to Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, Besides, it's your choice. It's like it's, if, your, if, if it's, it's like it's your choice, obviously. Well, if it's a ch uh, if it's one of those challenge ones, like I was told about Mega Man X, I'm not going to do that. I would just prefer to play them casually. Just it's basically enjoy them. No, 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 no. It's like too. the Nuzlocke thing basically means that if one of your Pokemon yeah. fans <laughs> that's all, you have to store that Pokemon you and never use it for the entire No. Oh my god. Okay. Do <clears throat> it. I said the Nuzlocke. Challenge basically means if one of your Pokemon faints in battle, you have to store that Pokemon and never use them again for the whole. Play. And he wouldn't like that either. Uh, yeah, uh, that doesn't sound. I know, that's that, why uh, I'm still here. Yeah, no, 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 I know. That's why it's a suggestion. So what was your suggestion? <laughs> uh, no. no, no. Uh, I thought for a sec I thought for a second make a challenge where like every us after s every certain number of gems he would have to hunt for a shiny yeah. Pokemon to add to his First team, all, but the odds on the shiny Pokemon for different games so long that it would take way. But no, seriously, like I meant games. Oh, okay. Um, I have no idea what you're able I've, to play. I've already so put you. Bart, what else to subject you to? 
No, no. <laughs> Enter the dungeon. Hmm. Ooh. Mm -hmm. That's yes. Funny like me and Zola um, still in the game. Games gun. I hate. Hmm. I already played some games that I hated in the past. You won't be able to find them again because they had no value. Ellie knows oh, no what way. I'm I got about. it. I... Okay, what what is Zola it? Zola have... uh huh. Oh, I know exactly so... what you're talking. Oh god. But so you're we'll... asking for like donation goals while I'm in while I'm prep. This was a mistake on your part. Yeah. Yeah, Golden. Mm -hmm. um, what's your highest donation goal? Because I have a good idea. <laughs> Getting over it with Bennett Foddy. No! Uh -huh. God, Are you fucking God. kidding me? <laughs> I, I, I need... Okay, I need to see you play the game. I've heard you play the game, but I need to... <laughs> you want, you want yeah. to witness me suffer trying to get that asshole in his black <laughs> cauldron all the way up with the worst fucking controls in the world. If I'm gonna if I'm gonna suck into a game like that, I'm gonna put that at like 500 or something, an unreachable. Yeah, that's number. why. That's, that's why I was. That's what I was saying. Make it a high goal. One was so I didn't know. And plus, a lot of people would pay to see you do that. No, I wouldn't. I wouldn't need it. That guy did no person. Hey, babe. But what's a really bad game that you can think? Hey, Golden. Ride to Hell, Re Golden. Ride to Hell Retribution. Oh my God, I am bred. No. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Oh, I am no. bred. I'm trying to think of like. Well, okay. I will tell you this much. I, because the game is 3D, I, mean, I don't know if it will want, work like, on this computer. Bad. Just think of like any license on the Nintendo. Like any license. One of anyone. the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle game. Oh my um, God. Okay, for TMNT games. The very first Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle game. How about that? Oh, the very first TMNT game. Um, I might look into oh, wait, that. Oh no, wait, 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 I got one. Okay. Any any selected okay. game, made by by LJ. Oh, no, LJ no, 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 no! Come on. <laughs> no games from yeah. Well. I Let's just realized see. what I was about to say. Let's do a let's just not. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I've already suffered through one LJN game. I suffered through another LJN game, but was later deleted because I got many... nothing out of it. Wait, how many games does that company have? Like 32 More than you would... Yeah. yeah. It has quite a handful. <laughs> yeah, it's a lot more than you would think with their quality. <laughs> logic. Don't die, please! Jesus, Logic. I, okay, okay. <laughs> my body just decided it really didn't <laughs> mean to stop coughing. It does that sometimes. But yeah, 32 games. Fucking hell. Yeah, no. That's um, uh, I so mean, no an LJ Endgame, it just... Um... Okay, I cannot... Nightfall, I can't do Pokemon Platinum. What I was thinking of for the first Pokemon game was Pokemon. Uh -huh. if, if I may finish. Um, Sorry. The first Sorry, Pokemon game I would do is um, Pokemon Yellow. Uh, ah, uh, yes. And Classic. like, and, and afterwards I could do like Pokemon Crystal and maybe Pokemon Emerald. Okay, so there's always the red and blue. E Emerald. Or red. Emerald. Yeah, yeah. There was red and blue, and then there was uh, gold and silver. I would yeah. pretty much go for that third entry, for I don't know, even sake or something like that. It's a good. Idea. It's a good what? Ellie, I didn't yes. Catch, I didn't catch what you said. It's a good what? I said that's a good idea. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Pokemon ye uh, Yellow. That's something I would. The third use. third um game to be like the most comprehensive. It's not me or it's Golden. Keep cutting out. <sighs> Discord is like that. Discord's being. Discord's being. Cool. Discord's being a dick cord. Yeah. <laughs> that was not fun. That that sounds kinky. <laughs> oh my god, Hi, my name is Eliora. Have we met? I've well, met. Then Joy said, not safe for work in his servers. Join Ellie. Dick Cord. I've, oh I've missed you, like a lot. <laughs> okay, I think you give one to. Uh... 
We could have a uh, we could have a sequel to the clusterfuck comedy fest that was you playing yeah. Doom while me and Solar oh and everyone were there. I've actually tried to set up Doom, but unfortunately, no. Like, so wing? What the hell? Take so wing said dick. A hashtag dick cord X fire shot. No. Oh my god. WTF? Oh my god, that's so wrong. I hate that shit so much, but god. But back to what I was oh. saying. Um, when I tried starting up Doom 2, I can't change the resolution size like I could with the first Doom, and I don't know why. And that's a problem uh -uh. because it would be too small for me to try to focus on the screen. Oh, oh I got one. I got a perfect idea. All right. Try playing any try, try playing any Mario game, but in corrupted style. A corrupted what? Mario game. What? <laughs> yeah, there are. There's a. There's corruption app. There are corruption programs that you can use that will corrupt your emulator. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, is, Why? It, is this something? Uh, is it? That. I I think there was a YouTube channel that was dedicated to that. I think it was called um. Yeah, not... Vine Sauce Vinny. He he does that. Why would you do this? Because it's so that to that watch. that sounds so hilarious. So a corruptive okay, Mario game. One. I think I got one. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, um, for like one of the milestones, try playing one of the well-known games that's like that was like a thing a while back that was done by those pro that program the RPG. Maker. There's a few RPG maker games that they have made that are relatively interesting, but I think you'll have a good laugh out of those. Um, RPG maker games actually, in my experience, they tend to be pretty nice. I would have to yeah. look into that. Like, I would have to get the experience of it. Uh, the other thing is, is that if it comes to RPG titles, mm -hmm. because I'm, I think I'm getting mixed up with something else, but actual RPG games, they're really, really long, or at least most of them. Like, Final Fantasy VI and Chrono Trigger, those take a while to play through. This one's, a, like, the one I can think of, like, that won't take as long, because I know the whole game itself didn't take some players too long. It's, uh, one of them was known as Misa. It was like a Japanese-inspired uh, RPG. Hmm. Maybe. In it, horror. Yes, in the horror genre. Markiplier has played it. Um, Wait a second. Was that the one it. where you got crushed by uh, a couple of walls? Got crushed. You got kind Yay of for Discord. Thank you, Thanks. Discord. You had one fucking job. <laughs> oh, now what's you gonna there and make that? No. Even as he's, he's like, even as he's freaking cursing out Discord, it's cutting him off. It's like, er, <laughs> ah, e, er, ah. Now what were you trying to say? Anyways, um, is that the, is that the one game Markiplier was playing where the character got crushed by a wall if they did something wrong? No, that was Witch's House. The, yeah, the one I'm talking about is based off of, uh... The character you play as, whose whose school ends up becoming cursed because of this one girl named Misao got killed. Hmm. Okay. And basically, the whole point of freeing her spirit, apparently, is to collect her body parts. And you put them on top of this head. What? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Fun fact. The like, fun fact. The. Pretty much the big bad of the story is this teacher who was really, really, really into Misao and so cut her up into different body parts and spread them around the school before oh, the curse began. my ass. What the yeah. hell? Yeah. Why did he do it? I don't know. Because Japan! Yeah, he did it because Japanese horror. It's supposed to be the idea about Japanese horror in general. There are some people who... There are some people who have really disturbing character backgrounds and such, and he, this teacher was no different in the game. He but was the whole, twisted, and he, he was, didn't have redemption. Yeah, he did not. Again, Even Markiplier admitted it. Admit it. <laughs> and the game forced you to give it to him. Yeah, in order to free Misao's spirit, technically. To truly free it from the darkness. Quote, unquote. But Witch's House is another one where he he also played that well, there's this played it as well. But um in this one she this little girl gets trapped inside a haunted house and everything in that haunted house is a potential basically, if you're not careful. 
Hmm. Hmm. That's disturbing. It's horror yeah. genre. It's gonna be crazy. I, I don't <laughs> like horror. But yeah, the funny Japanese thing is, some of this. But uh, the the funny thing is that particular horror, those things in that game. Even watching him play, they weren't even that bad to me. Like, embarrassing to because they were like very extremely terrifying. The setting wasn't even that terrifying to me either. So, in all honesty, it wasn't that bad for horror. If you wanted a better example. Play Corpse Bride. That's a good, better example of horror. Corpse Bride? Heck, it's so... Corpse... Not, no, uh, Corpse Party, not Bride. Corpse oh, Party. Oh, dear. I was to say, Corpse Bride is a good... My bad, wrong name. Yeah. I tried... It's like, I watched PewDiePie, or Cryotic, play some of Corpse Party, but then a particular scene happened, and it actually broke me. I... It actually caused me... One of my... Fucking freaking blue periods of depression to come uh, early because I get those sometimes, and the game actually brought one of them on early. So I was like, <laughs> no, no, never again, never again. Oh, I just realized what's corpse. Sorry, guys, I gotta bounce. All right, oh, okay. Bye. Later. Now, okay. if Everything. if if uh. Getting over it with Bonifati is it becomes a goal. I would I would set that to a really high goal because that's a game that yeah, I that... want. That's a game I don't want to touch, and I would want to purposely put it to an unreachable goal. Like, yeah, if you're really that desperate, try. Because I could be quite I, stubborn with that. I wouldn't that. like to see you. I wouldn't like to see you play it either. I would like bow out. Oh, did El sorry, I left the room for a moment. Did Ellie already left? Yeah, yeah, yeah. she is. Oh, yeah, totally oh well. Um. Yeah, Course Party was definitely an example of a good, of a horror game that they that even somebody created an anime for it. Yeah. Um, and, then, <laughs> and that I'm serious. That game was disturbing. Corpse Party broke me as a human being for a, quite a long time. Yeah. Me too. And you know what broke me? What? What? The scene where Psycho dies. Oh no! Okay, so this is a game on Steam. About. I know, no, what, no. I know yeah, what you're talking about. That no. scene broke me. I had to turn it off. I wouldn't watch anything for like a week. Derek, there's no bliss. Uh, oh my god. Derek, it, it, the, the person, the person you're bliss. hearing is not Mighty Bliss. Derek, you fucking fucking. <laughs> yeah, you get the point. Derek, you knew very well that it was not Blissy. She was off a long time ago. Why am I. <laughs> God dang it. I guess it's because you and Bliss sound alike. And when I. Um, you Bliss. shush, Nightfall. It, it's. I, I can still tell that you, uh, apart you from Bliss, but. I don't so I don't think I sound like Bliss. She didn't rewatch well, the vo stream. Okay, to be fair, your like voices sound different to people when they hear them play back to themselves. Uh, yeah. Uh, what? Z Z Zleffer, I see what you did there. You Wait, motherfucker. What? Oh. Oh, corpse party. Um, the game is not exact it's not easy it's like very disturbing to play it's hard to play the difficulty comes from having the motivation to move on after half the shit you see in that game Someone yes Luigi, asked. man i'm a texan yes oh i get uh, it thankfully, <clears throat> thankfully uh everyone's getting the picture that i am not jasper because people are barely uh, confusing that. How the fuck do you sound like Jasper? Jasper was a lot more exaggerated in his voice. Exactly. Yeah, people yeah. have been people have been confusing the Jasper for the last one and a half years. Ooh. But I, I think I found a game that some of you would probably want me to play. Mm -hmm. It's hard. I mean, it's a Castlevania <laughs> game. Bless you. Bless you. Castlevania Bless Dracula you. X. Okay. Dracula X. Yeah. That's just you know an idea to throw out there. Um, I don't think I mean, I've heard of that one. You haven't heard of it because it didn't sell very well when the game came out. Um, ah. Yeah. Huh. 
But let's see. But yeah, the thing is about Corpse Party is it's not it's not because it's easy. It's hard to play because the scenes involving the horror parts of it are very hard to stomach. They can get very detailed to put it. Ugh. Now it, they're uh, saying hi to my mom. I can't even <laughs> people in the chat. I still Mama Knight. <laughs> oh, here was a game that I once played but rage quit on. Kid Clown oh, and Crazy Chase. No, what? I do not like clown. No one Hi, likes clown. Ah! <laughs> you know what? what? Did I scared you, Logic? What? I was doing a quote from Pennywise, and you. No, I. No. no. So, um, uh, Keyframe just um. Yes, Derek. I know about. I know that it's a um, a ported version of Rondo of Blood, but there's a whole different story behind that. No, uh, Keyframe suggested that I would play those Mario Education knockoff games, like Mario is Missing oh or some god. shit. Oh god, those games! <laughs> no. Oh god, that'd be no. a torture of its own. <laughs> oh my god. So, um, what, what what is there? There's Mario is Missing, Fun with Numbers, I think, and. Ah, uh, what's that? Oh yeah, one there's the Mario's time machine. There's also Mario Hotel. Oh, Mario Hotel was part of the uh, Philips CDI. I wouldn't be able to access that. Oh, Math Blasters! I know what game. Math Blaster was so much fun. There Wait, was like more that? than. Math Blasters was one of the few learning-related game programs where it was spacey themed, and it was all about learning math skills. It was really and fun. I and I think I'm familiar with that, but it was a MMO that I played and not... All toes, just toes, toes. I, I remember playing Jumpstart, though. There was another one I used to play that was a learning program. Oh, it was um, it was different from others because uh, one of the things that stood it out, it was voiced by Howie Mandel. One of the characters was voiced by Howie Mandel. Magical Star, I think that's <sighs> way too high. Okay, I'll save it that. Hmm. Chrissy was sweet enough to get me something from a restaurant that we like to go to every now and then. No. Oh. Don't mind the yelling in the background. She's yelling at the cat. Hey guys, listen to Keyframe. What? No matter where we go. He will always try to find mozzarella sticks. <laughs> we could be Why a would you do Ramsey restaurant? Yeah. And he would ask, Do you guys have mozzarella sticks? <laughs> <laughs> Golden, do you like he mozzarella sticks? I've seen really? unironically like the McDonald's mozzarella sticks when they were still around. Ugh. Wait, McDonald's did mozzarella, mozzarella were, sticks? At least they were cheap. Yeah. And you know what? They're probably better than that McRib. Oh my you god, don't remind me of that. I had to. You human garbage disposal. Wait, I didn't know McDonald's did mozzarella sticks too. It was pretty, it was uh, temporary. He loves mozzarella oh. sticks, and at Rigatoni's they have these giant fucking mozzarella sticks, and he likes them, so I got them for him because I got my first paycheck from my from this animation channel I now work at as a color keer, so I wanted to get something nice for my boyfriend. Thank you. You're welcome. Did you everyone's teeth just rot from that sweetness? You, you got your you got your small taste of Chrissy actually being a sweet, cute little person. Don't get used to it. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so, um, I think I have um, some ideas listed down. So, uh, there was Mario's Missing, Fun with Numbers, Mario's Time Machine. Uh, those are games that are on the SNES, so that's definitely accessible. Um... Which one would I pick, though? That's the tough one. I think Mario's Missing is the one most people recognize, so maybe I could try that out. Yeah, that's the one that's the most recognized one out of all of them, so I definitely think that'd be a good choice. Okay. Cheese in Montreal sticks. Dangerously cheesy. <laughs> I like anything with extra cheese. That, that's me. Um, I'm trying to remember... 
Uh, the name of the game that was um, that Howie Mandel voiced the character for, it was called Little Howie's uh, Great Word Adventure. Great Word Adventure? Yeah, Word. W O R D. It was Wait, a little voc. It was like a, a vocabulary related game, learning game. And it voiced. It had Howie Mandel voicing a little bear character named Little Howie. Word Neat. Muncher. Huh. But yeah, the game itself was actually really fun to play. Like I used to play it so many times when I was a kid, and I I still remember the game so well. Yeah. Um. What's the name remember. of it? Uh, Little Howie's Great Word Adventure. Little Howie's Great Word Adventure. Let me try to look for that. Yes, <laughs> trust me, you'll know it. You'll know it. If you, it, you'll know if it's the one because I would recognize the game. It's so quickly because the art style is the easy classic cartoonish kind of art style. That is you this see a that like a PC game sort of thing? Yes, it was a PC learning game. Toon Land. Okay, I think I remember that. If it rings a bell, hang on, just wait for the page to load. Okay, I remember Toon Land. I used to play around with that stupid thing. It, it's eh, like That's all you do it. is you just click on things, but uh, so these are like obstacles in these little Howie uh, games. Yes, it was like it. It's like basically you are supposed to figure out um, uh, like stuff in the game. Little Howie was voiced by Howie Mandel, and he. I think this is like one of the games he devoted Wait, himself. Was he this? Was that the? Is that the uh, that dude who sounded like Bobby? From yes. Bobby's World. Okay, yes. yeah, this is all coming together now. Gotta remember that. Um, yeah, it's Howie. Little, it's Howie Mandel, man. <laughs> that was like one of the few voice actor, uh, like comedian voice actors I remembered so well because my mother used to watch his uh, comedy show so much when I was little, and we used to watch. A there was an actual cartoon that how we did about little form. Bobby. If right. you remember little Bobby, that was him. It really <laughs> all depends on, like, I think I would be able to find it online and, like, just download it as, like, a small executable file. Like, I was able to, um, at one point, I was able to download and actually play the old Rita Rabbit games. I don't know if any of you are familiar with uh, Rita Rabbit. Rita Rabbit, Tom I think I, I might have. No. I think uh, I might have. Okay, so, nope. yeah, basically, Reader Rabbit is this somewhat activity obstacle sort of game that's fairly simple, but they the, the challenge is fun, and it's got some very colorful art, and the music, it has a very nostalgic place for me, personally. Um, oh, Derek, where where in the world is Carmen Sandiego? That was another one that I used to I've love. I've heard a so lot of Carmen Sandiego. <laughs> there was even, like, a game show based off of Carmen Sandiego. That was a good that was a good game is that's a c my... that's uh obviously that's a cd rom game series right yep yes it was okay. it was one of the few cd rom i would have games to look like up on that one well um so aside from pc games what else let's see i have getting uh, over it mario's missing oh you know it's one cd rom game i miss so much what? lego island lego island <laughs> who does not remember lego island I know which one you're talking about. I don't know, but... Oh, mm. shit, I just remembered. It's basically an what? open world... That, it's basically an open world exploration of, uh, of well, Lego Island. You just, like, create your own car, your own... Uh, like, you create your own right. racetrack, your own... Uh, uh, your own... Uh, oh, my God, uh, the dog. Uh, buggy. Your own uh, jet ski. It, it, it was a really addicting game. You can also interact with so many of the Lego uh, characters walking around, too. Okay, so, um, how about this? I actually spoke to uh, Oregon Trail. Is Oregon Trail available on Steam? I'll have to look. Oregon Trail. Wait, but what? Oregon? Wait, hold on. I'm... Let's see if it's. No, that's not the game. I actually. Anyways, um. Thinking about. A friend of mine who goes by the name of Cedrus, He's also a fan of retro games. Believe it or not, there is actually a Tetris Two, like a sequel. For the SNES. Oh, I know what who Cetris is. I talk to him time to time. I think no, like nobody's heard of this one. Yeah, like it, that, that's actually a thing. 
Mm. No one tell Lightning Bliss. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> yeah, don't. Wait, this is part of the best selection? Still, like, I'm surprised I've never heard of this, but... I This could be, like, a blind, like, let's play on this one. I think that would be very interesting, especially for Bliss. <laughs> Trigger and her fucking OCD. Oh, my God. Poor Bliss. Golden. Yes? I, um, was thinking, since I'm only gonna buy, um, a bundle, and it's cheap right now, um, when I get my money, um, can I, um, gift you something? Oh, sure. What did you have in mind? Either Shantae Hat Genie Hero or the, um, other game that I have on my wish list. Shantae. Shantae's a game series that, um, that I might be able to check out. I will tell you this much. Because Shantae's made from the same people who did the DuckTales remastered, I may not be able to stream the game. Either that Probably. or Page Story Plus, because I remember Bonsato streaming that. Hmm. And, Magical, you are right, Bliss would strangle Golden for playing that at game. It would be oh, fucking oh, worth it. Bliss. <laughs> Beard, shut up! Golden fucked it. Blissy versus Cetrus 99. No. <laughs> Wait a second. Is Cetrus actually in the chat? I'm looking. Uh, no, right now. it's not. Okay. I don't think so. For a second there, I was going to say, like, hey, Cetrus. Oh, like... like, yeah, because I, I, I just remember that. I'm like, you know, let's make that a donation goal. Like, that can be the first donation goal. I'll, I'll keep it lowest. Oh, my God. Morpheus, shut up. You're evil. <laughs> Is versus the world. <laughs> I can't do Tetris 99. I would have to get a no. capture card and a switch and everything. <laughs> you're fighting the world. <laughs> well, he's not wrong on that game. You're not wrong. <laughs> it, Cape Story, it's a pit lights game, though, too. Um, probably. Uh, oh, Dr. Mario. Yeah. That's another puzzle like game. Um, I am Dr. Mario, and I am saving life. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I'll probably send a link to you and Dan what Cape Story Plus is on Steam. I've, um, <sighs> I, I really need to stick to what you guys want, though. I mean, this is just a fun little suggestion here. Um, I would, I think Dr. Mario would be fun to play, honestly. <laughs> so Dr. Mario, okay. Game. You know what? Let me ask the chat. Dr. Mario or Tetris 2? Take your pick. Tetris 2. Okay, I'd so, say Dr. Mario. Okay, so Jesse says Dr. Mario. Nightfall says uh, Tetris 2. Mm. I'd say go with the majority vote because I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm with Logic here. Morpheus said Tetris 2. Um, Morp <laughs> we got another Dr. Mario. Another Tetris 2. Okay, so Tetris 2 so far, it's a little bit in the lead. <laughs> Tetris 2 Magical again. Star said Tetris 2 Tetris oh, 2, Tetris two. Oh. I said Tetris 2 I, right. think they are, I think the only reason why they wanted to Is because they want to trigger Blissey No, like, <laughs> I don't I actually just want to enjoy the game That's watching well, Morpheus obviously admits it She didn't go to the <laughs> corner <laughs> All right, I'll start mm -hmm. setting up some uh, little donation Magical! goals here. Magical! Go to the corner! What did Magical say? Hang on, I gotta take a look. We all, all... want to see su Blitz suffer. And no, they, hey, they like, to s they like to see me suffer, so that's no surprise I there. Don't. I Where don't. Where are we? <laughs> I came here. I, I don't want to see anyone suffer. Yeah, actually. good luck trying to get over that. So. Oh my God. Mario's missing... Honestly, there's not a lot of games that make me react badly when it comes to stuff like that because pretty much a, uh, I use it to keep my mind occupied, so it doesn't really affect me as many people would think. Okay, so people so, want more like, uh, Tetris too. So any Ca GB Castlevania games you'd like to play? Ooh, um, Ooh, Castlevania. I have never. That's the thing. I have never played any of the Castlevania games on the uh, Game Boy Advance. Ooh. Actually, That'd be a good idea. Hang on, let me see what I have. I have Advanced Wars, barely touched it. Aria of Sorrow, Circle of the Moon, Harmony of Dissonance. There's Mario versus Donkey Kong, that's old. Um, Metal Slug, um, 
Metal Slug? I forgot that was a game. <laughs> oh, God, I love Metal Slug. Um, I forgot that game. Let's see what else Blood I got. Bloodlines is actually sounds... Bloodlines sounds really interesting, though. Yeah. Oh, Bloodlines for the Genesis. I've never beaten it. I've been trying to play through that game. Okay, compared to the other um, Castlevania games... Uh, Bloodlines is one of those games where if you actually die, like, it, it actually has a system of a lot, um, a continue system. Whereas yeah. in the original Castlevania game, you can go as far as you want, but it's hard as fuck. <laughs> it's just, it, it, it's a test of your patience. But in Castlevania Bloodlines, you can actually get a game over that will send you back to the beginning of the game. Oof. Yeah, I would have twenty dollars after that. <laughs> Metroid Fusion. I will be looking forward for you to playing that one. Metroid Fusion as well as Super Metroid. I wanted to do like one month where I would do a marathon of the uh, major Metroid games. However, if I were to do the first Metroid, I would do Zero Mission instead because that's a remake of the first, and it's probably a right. lot more doable. And if I were to stream the original Metroid, I would have a fucking aneurysm in the worst way possible. <laughs> Nobody would like that. No. Um, I love I like the story behind both Super and Metroid uh, Fusion. Though both of those games are really Oh, Super Super Metroid is easily my favorite game, period. I can I I know that. I asked you that once. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Um, I've been trying to think of an idea to play that. Like, I thought about doing that on, like, as, like, a birthday bash. But, unfortunately, um, because uh, Ellie's wedding is happening, there's not going to be much people around. So, I would have to say that right. for another time. Right. Um, I would say save Metroid Fusion and Super Metroid for during Halloween time. Because those would both make perfect Halloween games. I, I, I know where you're coming Fusion. from. I know where you're coming from. But there's like a there's a lot of other games that are a lot more Halloween based, and personally, I always like to think of the Metroid series as something much more universal and not just, you know, it's straight up horror because they're life threatening things. But I you know where you're coming from. Personally, I would want to do that like during the summertime because why the hell not? I at least want to do super. <laughs> I at least want to do Super Metroid like before BronyCon. I think that would be. Oh, that'd be perfect. Yeah, that'd be good. Yeah. yeah. I'm looking forward to seeing you guys at BronyCon, by the by. <laughs> Yay! Is there... I already got my room. I got a room. Now I gotta get a flight ticket. I'm jelly. Are you good? Are you excited? I mean, all excitement. I'm already... I'm already I hope you can all enjoy prepared. it. See what else Logic and me can't go. I'm sorry that you can't go, Logic. It's kind of, it's a big bummer for you, man. It is. Let's see. Sonic okay. Advanced, Wario Land 4, autism. Zelda the Minish Cap. He. So, uh, Golden, when you play Minish Cap, please make sure I, I can get on because I can help you throughout that game. It may. Like, I... uh, okay. Um, I will say this much. As far as Zelda games go, I can be extremely picky. Like, I'm going to say this much, and you're going to... A lot of people are going to be... Well, actually, most of them already know, but still, some would just be like... <gasps> um, I did not enjoy Majora's Mask at all. It was one of the most frustrating yeah. games. Like, barely even started, and I got too frustrated and rage quit. I honestly don't blame you on that. And I'm it's, actually okay. It's, it's, you're going to think I'm one of those few who and would it's, not... And just ahead, for the sorry. record, it's not because of the time um, the time pressure that was uh, programmed into it. Nor is it the tone. I actually was fine with the tone. I love that this was a Zelda game that tended to be darker than its predecessors. True. But it's the same shit that irritated me with a lot of other games that involve exploring. You get stuck. You have no idea where to go. And apparently there was something you were supposed to do. And the game never hints it to you. And it pisses me off. And every time I point that out, people say, oh, well, the game's not going to hold your hand. Well, in something like that, you're going to need to hint something a little better so that way I'll be able to make progress. Because otherwise, if I'm stuck roaming around roaming around, and I'm bored to death for the past hour, I'm just going to shut off the game. Because yeah, I feel like I, I'm wasting my honestly, time. Honestly, I don't blame you on that. Um, mm -hmm. Link's Awakening, I've been making some progress, and... I, personally, I would like to uh, do a stream of that game. I've already made some progress. I don't know. Like, I want to first, like, try to finish the game. So that way, I'll be prepared on what to do. That's the other thing when it comes to Zelda games. Is that yeah. 
I would have to have the experience of it. The only Zelda games I've ever beaten were um, A Link to the Past, and I've beaten that multiple times, and Ocarina of Time. That's it. Ah, Ocarina of Time. The starting stone to many Zelda fans. Yes, and a lot of people consider it to be the most overrated game, which it's, yeah, I, I think that's true, but it's still, I think it's a fun game. It's one of the most classic, iconic Zelda games of all time. Of course, it's going to be seen as overrated over time. Yeah. So, I think. Not... Uh, uh, Ocarina of Time. Ah, uh, yes. Yeah, if I, had a, if I had a capture card and. A... <laughs> what, what did he say? Macarena of Time. <laughs> hey, Macarena. Macarena. <laughs> But no, um, <laughs> but, uh, God damn it. Ocarina of Time and, uh, Link to the Past were the only Zelda games I have actually, like, beaten. I'd be lying if I didn't say that there were times when I had to look up a strategy guide. Now, I was, I was told every now and then that playing, uh, using a strategy guide or having someone backseat gaming is, like, cheating the game. No, it's not. It is not. I call bull on that. I Me agree. Too. There's going to be some parts where you're going to need some help. I even yeah. do that with games. I had to research it. Like, how do I do this? I I think that's total bullcrap for people to say that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but some people like doing the fucking gamer elitist thing. It's stupid. It's freaking suicide for the, the for the anybody who does videos there's, there's the other thing where there are times i want to try to play the game and try to figure everything out on my own and then there's shit like that and sometimes i feel like i'm too stupid to play a game based off of that mm -hmm. and I, sometimes i don't know if whether or not it's a good idea to use a strategy guide to make any progress mm -hmm. so I don't well, you know. won't really have to worry too much about um, Minish Cap because theirs is actually pretty straightforward. Yeah, I, I heard that Minish Cap tries. is. Yeah. I heard that Minish Cap is like the shortest entry in all the Zelda games. I don't know how true that is. It is actually. It's pretty straightforward. It's pretty quick, and they at least guide you to where they where you need to go. Like they point to where you need to go okay. in the map and everything. So if you're stuck and you're like, "Where am I supposed to go?" You just look at the map and it'll point to where you go, and it's like, "Oh, I need to go there." Okay. <laughs> Like, that's one of the good things about it. Like, they help you, at least, to get to where you need to go. Going through the dungeons doesn't take long at all. Like, they're pretty straightforward. There are some points where you have to think a little bit more, but other than that, they're not too bad when it comes to a game. Mm -hmm. Good video games give you that sense of having to work for, you know, winning. Yeah. Right. There are times when I spoke to other people, like, and I'm not just, you know, talking about Zelda when it comes to looking up strategy guides. I mean, like, in general, like... Right, right. Uh, like, I I'm going to go ahead and just get this off my chest. Aside from Majora's Mask, other games I had a frustrating time playing was uh, Mass Effect and, EG, you're going to hate me for this, Kingdom Hearts. I, of course. I, <laughs> that was one of the most, like, that was one of the biggest struggles I've ever had for <laughs> years trying to get into the game. Like, I've made progress, like... <laughs> finishing up a lot of worlds like okay at one point i finished like a majority of the worlds like i finished uh there was tarzan alice in wonderland and hercules afterwards i'm like okay what do i do now i went back to traverse town i browsed around the map and i'm just like what, what, what's next and somebody said something about ringing a bell in traverse town i'm like nobody said anything about that oh this character said it okay was i supposed to talk to him how was i supposed to know about that <laughs> yeah, yeah. The first game had really bad gimmick. That, that yeah. happens when, bad when you're not smart. Like, I I could actually do that. With there are, that's like one of the examples where you if you don't do when you explore and you don't bother talking to all the people in the game, that's gonna be one of those scenarios. So that is yeah. understandable. Yeah, the first game was extremely gimmicky, which makes it super difficult. Uh, the maybe second one the was a little bit... Maybe the second and third game are better. Probably. I heard some people say that. And while I do appreciate them trying to be helpful, trying to play two and three first is like trying to skip chapters in a book. 
That is true. So that's that's. I, uh, um, for me, I actually sk sometimes I skip over a season of um a show and then go back to season one. That's how <laughs> I am. So I would just oh. actually skip one. To each their own. Yeah. So yeah, um, with the Minish Cap, I won't mind a bit of backseat gaming. I just hope that. Upon playing the game, I just hope that nobody thinks I'm being a shitty player because I'm being helped. No, you're not. No, you're not. No, it's, no, it's helpful to get um to get um guides and stuff to help. It's helpful yeah. if like if say if there's somebody who has played the game and they can give you a, a like a quick tip on how to get through a certain area faster than normal, then that's not a big deal. That just shows that it makes it a lot easier for you to play the game. Yeah, if I were to uh, bring this up as well, like I always help out Watch whenever he's stuck in Kingdom Hearts three. Uh, so uh, not just that, but we've been also been helping him out, uh, helping them out in the first and second games when he was streaming. Exactly. Okay. I know mm -hmm. that you and Watchful are like. It seems like you guys are really, really close friends, like online close friends. Yeah. So, uh, that doesn't sound surprising. E.G., oh, but... you and I are both Kingdom Hearts fans. Like, okay, there are there times when Watchful, uh, it picked the wrong... <laughs> okay, you know that's... You know that part of the beginning of the Kingdom Hearts... Of each main Kingdom Hearts game where you had to pick the shield, sword, or staff? Oh, God, yeah. Yes. Oh, I'm God. Gonna... If anyone picks the wrong one, I cringe... I get triggered like shit. <laughs> yeah, no, that's You're really not irritating me when I find... I go... I go lightning bliss triggered. No, okay, you I, will, I, will, I will tell you this case. much. After, yeah. like, trying to make progress in the game, I saw a video where it says, like, if you pick the sword, you're going to have a difficult time at the end of the game, so you might as well just restart the whole game. And I'm just like, ah, ah, oh, all the serious? progress! Kiss I my ask ass! What I would the ask fuck? You. Don't, it's, you shouldn't say that! Like, come on. I would actually pick well, the sword, it though. it is kind of true, because the first game was super difficult. <laughs> it was. I, I'm not gonna lie. I, I, like, okay, as much as I stated that I don't like Kingdom Hearts, I, it, this could just be the expense of just the first game leaving a very, very bad impression. And I'm one of those people who are very picky of any first impressions I encounter. Ugh, ugh fucking hell. Mm. Nice. <laughs> At least you're not picky about your food like I am. <laughs> yes, you are. You prefer your steak well done. Shut up with that. Hey, no. <laughs> this, okay. Yeah, I'll bring that up. Okay, the steak is like the steak shaming bullshit is boring now. I'm just gonna, yeah. I please. just only mentioned it once. I only I mentioned it once. I stopped it doing the joke now. So. Yeah, it's, it has it has overstated its welcome. Like I feel like I may have overstated the whole kaboom. Um, over yes, uh, like did. overstated the whole kaboom joke. I'm sorry, I can't get over that when Bliss or Solo scares the <laughs> shit out of me. Am I really gonna defile this grave for money? No, it's like of course I, I am. Am I really gonna defile this fucking Christ? God damn it, Solar! Of course Honestly, I I'm am. Not gonna, I'm not gonna blame you on that because that those two were like the biggest good jump scares that I've ever seen anybody pull off. Oh yeah, no, Bliss was just hilarious. Solar's is just fucking epic. Because yes. if you notice later in the um, if you actually wa like aside from the uh, the you know the stupid highlight really made, if you actually watch the uh, the uh, episode itself that I still have my uh, on my second channel, you'll notice in the chat uh, log that everybody jumped like Jesus. I did. I was in there when it happened. <laughs> It's amazing. That's that. That's a whole new achievement that Solar did compared to Bliss. Now this yeah. is the, here's the thing. When that happened, I didn't even have any headsets on. And when he suddenly said that out of blue, I was like, "Good God, what the heck? <laughs> Solar!" <laughs> it scared me too, and I didn't have headsets on. That shows you how powerful that was. <laughs> oh, it was. <laughs> I still like the smolder one. Though. Poor magical Star Wars headphones that day. <laughs> oh god, yeah. Great headphone users. Oh. And yes, it, yes, Nick. Um, I am aware of which bosses you're talking about in Kingdom Hearts 2. Zaldin is one of them. Zaldin, Demix, and sometimes Sephiroth. Oh god. 
Dead Eggs was actually one of the few that was like the trigger to many players' minds, including Josh. <laughs> I hate I hate him as a boss, but I like him as a character. I like it as a character, but not as a boss battle. I agree. Wait, who are He's you guys funny... talking about? Denix, one of the main. Oh uh, my god! Yes, I, okay. I've seen Josh play that, yes. having a fucking seizure. He's like, he <laughs> looked... <laughs> yes, he did look like he was freaking out in such rage. I was like, good god! I thought Markiplier was scary when he's mad. <laughs> <laughs> guys, I came it... prepared when I completed. <laughs> People still thinking that Jet Jess is Bliss still. <laughs> oh my god! I just had another idea. Uh, this was kind of okay. This was shared from Cruiser on Discord. I might make this a donation goal. Hey guys, how do you feel about me suffering ET on the Atari? No! Oh, no! 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 I would not. Every I'm gonna be perfectly honest with you. I wouldn't wish that upon my worst enemy. Oh wait, 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 wait! No. Don't you mean, don't you mean E.T. Like, just shut up. up. Oh no! no <laughs> like the double, like the go. double E.T. Uh, like it, you e. know, the one that was portrayed in the, in, in the movie, in the AVGN movie. E.T. Found her. I love the, I love what the chat is saying. They're like, no. <laughs> like they're all it's like, like no. Yeah. Stuff and just no, you're gonna wake up. You're gonna wake up the uh, the monster death mothix. <laughs> <laughs> just don't waste your money on something like that. Oh, Faith, oh my sorry, god, god damn it. <laughs> what did you say? E G Studio. Okay, Faith, okay that was Bert funny. just suggesting something on a Sega Genesis. Let me see what I have on that one. There's a few games I can think of on Sega Genesis that would be good to play. There's a, there's a good handful of games. Genesis. Let's see. Aladdin, Altered Beast, Columns. Jungle Book. Aladdin. I don't have Jewish. Jungle Book, but okay. Comic Jungle. Zone. You don't have that one? Not yet. Uh, Contra Arch. Hard Corps, Cool Spot, uh, their version Arch. of Earthworm Jim, Echo the Dolphin. Oh my god. Good luck <laughs> trying to play that game. Sanic Genesis Golden App. Golden App. Yeah, no, that's a fun, that's a good um uh what is it called? The hack and slap no. Um it's one of those uh beat 'em up games. Uh Ghouls and Ghosts. Uh, Golden Look what Morpheus said. Oh Sanic Genesis. Thanks. <laughs> In Soviet <laughs> Russia, we call it Sachmarach. All right, so next, okay, so Golden, uh, Golden Axe, Gunstar Heroes. That's a fun game. Dude. Uh, Kid Chameleon, uh, Mickey Mania, the timeless adventures of Mickey Mouse. This is a oh. game that it's. Uh, that's my memory right there. That's a game that, like, you know how problematic the level design is. But I can't help but appreciate the um, the sprite animation and the idea behind the game. It's just not well executed. Yeah. So for those who don't know what Mickey Mania is, you play as Mickey Mouse through a series of classic uh, Mickey shorts from Steamboat Willie to the Mad Doctor to the Moose Hunter all the way up to the Prince and the Popper. I don't know half of these games are... Those are those are cartoon shorts, Nightfall, and they were no, all like no, they were... no, the games that you're showing on. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, okay. Castle of Illusion. I have yet to actually beat that game. Mutant League Football. I could not play that game for shit. Out of this world. Same thing. <laughs> Fantasy Star: The End of the Millennium. Never played it. Rocket Knight Adventures. Rocket Knight. Yeah. <laughs> That's a classic side scrolling game. Shinobi Three. Make... I made progress, but I never bothered to beat the game. Mm. Sonic and Knuckles. I don't mind mm -hmm. doing that game again. Um, I would just have okay. to practice with it. I don't think anybody's getting the idea that Morpheus was making a joke. Yeah, no, he, well, he's making a joke. And I'm making I a pun. It. And I'm making a pun. Jesus. Say it. Say Genesis. Sparkster, <laughs> Splatterhouse Genius. 2, Streets of Rage, Strider. Hyperstone oh, heist of what? Um, uh, someone has suggested that you should remake, redo the Donkey Kong Country playthrough. Nah. Look at what I'm Morpheus did. Rocket Nightfall. Rocket Nightfall. 
God damn it. <laughs> Okay. Uh, Vector Man, X Men, uh, X Men Two, Clone Wars. Oh my God. Yeah, I have he quite made... a handful of these ones. I haven't had much of playing them. Um, Castlevania Bloodlines. That's gonna be an attempt. I'm gonna try to get good at that game first before I stream that one. <coughs> what about Gunstar Heroes? Gunstar Heroes. I can always continue playing, like without like worrying oh. too much of a game over. Wade Song said, have you ever played a game called Dragon's Lair? Okay, um, I know what you're talking about. It's the one with the animation from Don Bluth. But there were also port uh, ports to, like, the NES and such. And they're horrible. Absolutely horrible. Like, they're unplayable. Oh, you're talking about that one. Yeah, uh, I'm going to pass on that. I'd rather suffer E.T. than play that. What about Space Ace <laughs> on the Super NES? No. Oh. <laughs> I thought so. Dude, EG, you weren't there Let when it happened. I was attempting to play there. bad games from AVGN, and Jesus fucking Christ. Barely five oh. minutes in. Like, I didn't, like, it was only four minutes of playing the game. I was done. I just yeah. shut it off. I lost oh, my shit. fucking patience. <laughs> Space Ace Space was Ace. actually really hard. Okay, here's a fun fact Space Ace, oh, the see. art behind that, if you recognize the art, then you would know that the the, the, uh, the one who did the art for the game Space Ace and uh, Dragon Slayer is Don Bluth. It, yes, Don Bluth, the yeah. creator of many classic uh, movies. Oh yeah, no, I'm very much aware of that. But the ports for like uh, the NES oh, yeah. and uh, SNES, oh my god, they can they can suck my dick. <laughs> I'll be back. Are you seriously gonna say this? Anyways, um, oh, I'm around. <laughs> It's an expression. It's not meant to be taken seriously. But, but, it's a but creepy streamland. I still the implications, streaming. though. And I agree, the arcade versions of both Ace, Space Ace and uh, Dragon Slayer are really challenging. Okay, I've, so I've seen says... people play the game, and I literally cannot. <laughs> I can't even get Let's through the game without dying. Let's some hard games to Golden, though. Wing oh, Commander. Speaking... I've I've tried that. I didn't make much progress, but it's definitely a, a very interesting simulator game. But then I was told the SNES version was not a very good port compared to the CD-ROM version. I'm just thinking, maybe I'll have to look up online to see if I can find those. Because I was told the Wing Commander games were really fucking good. Like, I've seen footage of the later entries, and your main character, I think, is Mark Hamill. Mark Hamill? Yes, Luke Skywalker. Oh! <laughs> okay, the, speaking of arcade games, it got me to remember one I used that I remember people would have played in this <laughs> one area I used to play or, like, used to go to a lot when I was a kid. I don't know if you're familiar with this one, Golden. Okay. The okay. name of the, the game is called Carn Evil. Carn Evil, okay. It is a horror shooting game. It is legit horror shooting game involving a carnival. And everything in it tries to kill you. <laughs> okay. It is insane. That, that, I, that was like one of the few games that I remember when I was little. It used to terrify me to death. Because those oh. monsters were creepy as heck. Okay, so um, somebody just noticed my uh, the library that I have on the NES. I have Battletoads. I already tried and done. Castlevania. Rage Quit. Contra, I would want a second player with that one. Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Nope. I didn't oh, no. <laughs> I didn't know the of that. <laughs> DuckTales, I already did that. Ghost and Goblins, Jaws, <laughs> Life Force. Oh, my God, no. Little Don't Mermaid, Mega Man, Metroid, Super Mario Bros. 2, 3, and 1. Are you going to redo Mega Man? Because Mega Man. Well, or okay, Mega I already did the Mega Man X series. Um. But the what the hell is Mega Man 2? <laughs> the, the game that you started to stream, like the first stream, the very first stream. Yeah, um, actually it was Mega Man X that I was going to try to stream for the first time. <laughs> um, oh. But um, I, could, I would love to do Mega Man 2. Like, I was able to make a lot more progress in that than it was with the first Mega Man. That one was just, oh my god. Sorry if you're hearing my daughter in the background again. <laughs> now it's you're fine. cute! 
Mega Man 2, I'll definitely look into, but I wouldn't want to make that as like a donation goal. Because that's, that's something. Okay. Try to hear golden. Because I want to try to like set goals of what people, like other people, would want the next time I stream. <clears throat> so I have Tetris 2, Mario is missing, and getting over it. My, oh, oh god. My daughter is like. She had to get her herself a band aid because she accidentally got hurt her little hand. Aww. But of course, she got, like seriously hurt. She just like had a little cut on it. It was a, it was it wasn't too serious. She just decided that she could grab her own band aid by herself like a big girl. Yeah. Aww, she's growing up. Hey. Adorableness, <laughs> <laughs> McCall. I need a um. I need to get a. Trail get grazer to make a vector of my daughter, so just in case if she gets into the highlight reels, <laughs> Golden will have like a little little that avatar of her popping in every now and then. <laughs> my side. Oh yeah. Uh, oh yeah. Wait, what are hold you on. Doing? I just looked at the chat. Somebody wants me to do Top Gun. <laughs> no. Yeah, watch oh, me try God. to land the plane. No. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't gonna touch that. <laughs> I ain't gonna touch that with a ten foot, a ten foot pole. Uh, Morpheus, lightning was not here. And Jess, not. Oh my <laughs> god. Morpheus, for the love of fucking that. god. <laughs> At least people stopped it. Um, confusing solar with golden, golden solar. <laughs> <sighs> I didn't get that part. <laughs> I'm being confused as lightning bliss, baby. <laughs> what? <laughs> she, okay, I, she was wondering what the heck I was talking about. I said, people on the chat are confusing me at, for lightning bliss. And she's like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> she's like, so, oh. Well, that's a surprise <laughs> Thanks a lot, you so, do you want to tell Morpheus, or shall I? <laughs> I made a tail. I made a tail. Okay, Morpheus, okay. the person you are hearing is not... It's not Lightning Bliss. It is Jesse. Or I Lucky. Have a problem with your daughter. Oh my God. A problem with your daughter? Nothing. No, there's no, nothing Morpheus. wrong with her. She just got a full cut and she took care of it. Morpheus, the person we're currently talking to is Jesse, not Lightning Bliss. Oh my god. And Jesse has a daughter. <laughs> yes. Oh my god. I, I do still... not sound like her! Oh my god! Even wait, so... in the call can actually... Let me guys. Let me guys. Really, guys? Oh. <laughs> 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 Even she said it. Say it again. Say it again. Morpheus, yes, for fuck's sake! I have the Super Star Wars games. <laughs> you have the Super Star? No, super, super Star Wars. Wars. Morpheus, seriously? Oh my god, even... Yes, E.G., please, get out of the... Get out of the... <sighs> please. Can you get it through your... <laughs> Go! Meanwhile, I have this Lightning stupid Bill Morpheus. Bath. Jesus Christ! I will bath the Morpheus right now. Morpheus, you better hope that you are don't at the Brody God. Don't make me go Super Saiyan three. Don't make me burn the right. chat. Morpheus, you better hope you're not going to be at Brody God because I will find you and I will give you a good bop it on the head. Bath him. <laughs> oh dear Lord. <laughs> God, this is the worst debate in the time. Hey, people confuse Solar with Fox. How? Jeez, this is worse because also, it makes it, what makes on it worse that subject, is because... how did anyone confuse Golden Fox with Solar? I can buy I the Lightning Bliss. No, can... they don't even sound alike. I can, buy... yeah. I can buy the Lightning Bliss and Jesse thing because, you know, if you think about it a little too hard, maybe. But with Golden and Solar, it's just like, bitch. You no. have, you have <laughs> somebody like me who is a bit of a dork whenever he talks, compared to Solar, so who's savage as fuck. So yes. I think Solar has a little deeper voice than Golden. Golden has a high voice. Yeah. yeah. Golden's voice is a little higher in comparison to Solar. Then, until he gets up close to the microphone. 
knife? No, he no, he does not knife fall. <laughs> Even when they're both up close, you can, they still have Golden's voice is still lower. It's still higher comparison to Solar. You said lower. I meant higher. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> yes, uh, Derek, I have, unfortunately, the uh, Wizard of Oz game. There's a Wizard of Oz game? Are you flipping uh -huh. serious? No, it was on the SNES, and it's absolute garbage. <laughs> oh my god. Is that the, is it that has the same the, one uh, no, ADGM review? It has the worst hit detection, the worst detection when trying to land precisely on every platform. It's a goddamn chore to play through. Isn't that the same game as uh, AVGM review? Yes. Oh god. What? I'd rather listen to Dark Side of the Moon than playing that. <laughs> Cause, you know, Dark Side of the Rainbow. Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and delete that. Not much in I had it's close it's too close to bedtime for me. So yeah, anyway. um Yeah, cause um has anybody ever watched the Wizard of Oz movie and while listening to while synchronizing it with Dark Side of the Moon? Oh, it actually fits so well. If you're wondering what my daughter was suddenly uh, saying in the back row, because I was, and then I mentioned not because it was too close for her bedtime. Um, my mom, I got my mom some cinnamon lollipops for Valentine's Day, and she likes them too. Cinnamon roll lollipops. Ah, what the fuck? No, close that cinnamon, down. Cinnamon, cinnamon flavored lollipops. There's mm -hmm. there an actual thing. Okay, I'm gonna oh wind. My God, I'm gonna. Morpheus. I'm gonna wind the clocks all the way back to. Let's see. Oh come on, that would be a perfect uh, for a ridiculous high donation. Go no. 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 I mean, no, no. by this point, I might as well just try like an LJN game because at least with LJN games, it's somewhat playable, <sighs> but insufferably playable. Uh, playable. Morpheus, I am going to flip and ignore that question because I like know in, you're just trying to get under my skin. It's like I saw, it's like I He's saw. He's a troll, but you expect. Go ahead. I saw, like, I saw Morpheus compare lightning to Je well Jesse to lightning once again, and I was like, "Fucking you, fucking fuck it." Well, yeah. I, <laughs> how long I know him? I mean, he, oh, he he shipped me with Little Master a few times though. Ah oh, shit! Well, Derek is yeah. a good spot. What? Wait, what? What? Is it the wall master thing? No, 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 no. Derek actually hit a good spot with LJN games. Back to the Future? Ooh. Hmm. Mm. I didn't know they had a Back to the Future video game. It's awful. <laughs> it's Isn't it? Yeah, yeah. It's basically... Oh. Okay, okay, the so second and third game play out like... Mar you're in a yeah, top like view. You're constantly moving. You're constantly at a running speed. You're collecting watches or clocks, and the music, it's just do 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 It's fucking okay. obnoxious. Like, beyond okay. your imagination. The one who say they that they were blaming themselves, it was, it's not, you were the one who started this whole thing. This started way back before you joined this whole thing. And, uh, screw you, Pixel Wing. Oh my god. <laughs> And they keep, they said tattoos. Wow, down. Pixel Wing, way to stereotype a fucking state, asshole. That is so cool. <laughs> <laughs> Text and pony sound alike. Screw you two. What? what if about Lightning, the if Lightning Bliss was himself? if Lightning Bliss was here, she might have act. Oh. It. Never mind. It, <laughs> okay, he's laughing at himself. Magical Star, I do not have home improvement for the SNES, although I'm afraid of playing that one too. How? What? It's solar, like a touching too. You're Isn't Home Improvement that game that has no instructions at all? <laughs> what? Even I think we saw admits to what Pixel uh, said. Dude, that's in. Pr that's pretty low. Except. Real men don't- SHUT UP! SHUT UP! <laughs> SHUT UP! <laughs> Damn it, Morpheus. <clears throat> wow, Morpheus. You do need destruction, it don't. 
if you're not like me and can do it without destruction. Morpheus, no one can do, No one can do anything without proper instructions. At least no, not proper. I can, I can sometimes in the game. Damn, Morpheus. Morpheus. Goop Troop okay, on serious? SNES. Okay, Goop Troop is one of those games that you would... you. I don't think you necessarily have to have a second player, but I think it would seem more appropriate to have a second player. Like, if if I would, it, I think it'd be nice. I could talk to Keyframe about that, <laughs> but I wouldn't make that a donation goal. That's just that an idea, though. That's interesting. I didn't know Goof Troop had a video game. It was, and it was made from Capcom, who owned the rights to Disney at that time. They also uh, made DuckTales. Um, yeah, they made yeah. DuckTales. They made Darkwing Duck, Chippendale, and those games are fucking amazing. They're beautifully well uh, designed. Chippendale! Elior! Uh, hey, uh, Elior streaming. What's up? Um, when you and Keyframe were playing Cuphead, what console were you on? That was for PC. Steam. Yeah. Oh, that was Steam. PC. Fuck! <laughs> Yeah, uh, Cuphead is only for PC and Xbox, sadly. Oh, no. Good luck trying to play that game. <laughs> someone, someone I'm not gonna lie. Guys, someone linked on an early order stream. There's yeah, she's streaming there. right now. Yeah, I better I better call this off. Okay, so I'm going to list the LJN game down. Um, out of this entire list, well, okay... I'm putting getting over it at like the highest one because I don't even <laughs> want to touch that. that. I, I don't want to touch that with a fucking yardstick. <laughs> but people I want stick. me to suffer it. But you mean the um, let's let's create a little poll here. Tetris two, Mario is missing, and let's put in back to the again. L J N back to the future. Okay, right. that'll be interesting to see. <laughs> okay, which of these three? Are you guys interested in the most? Tetris uh, 2. Tetris. Honestly, I'm curious about how you could make a sequel to Tetris. <laughs> Tetris 2. <laughs> um, I'd say I'm vote for Back to the Future because I've never seen this game. Okay. People are saying I'm one of them saying Tetris and Morpheus. I'm afraid you're gonna troll me if you find my DA. Tetris 2, Mario. Okay, Morpheus, if you promise her you won't troll her on her DA, she'll tell Tetris you what her, her DA is. A bunch of people are saying But Tetris you need to type too. it clearly. Yeah. Yeah, Tetris 2. Yeah. Okay, so there's three votes for Tetris 2. Four. No. Including no. me. Yeah, someone oh, just said the Tetris Yeah. Oh, yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, so that's five, actually. Okay. There's, uh, we Mario's got two... missing is mentioned a few times. All right. Uh, Back to the Future is mentioned by me and Derek. Okay. I say Tetris too. Oh, All right. so and okay. another Tetris too. All right, so wow. let's go ahead and uh, let's list that there. Um, <sighs> Everyone no, really, not that. really wants to see Tetris too. I only want to see it because. Uh game should i uh okay i don't know if morpheus is on a golden uh uh Discord no he, is he, he isn't no he isn't but he in my sir i want to go in there uh, oh morpheus fuck you shut up master wow. raid oh, wall master raid oh wow morpheus why what is wall master you don't don't tease like that. Okay, one thing I should mention to you, Golden, there are no there are no wall masters in Minish Cap, so you don't have to worry about them in that game. I can promise you that. Are there any wall masters in Link's Awakening? Um, I don't remember. I know that I there was a wall so. master in um, the Oracle of Seasons. I don't <laughs> think so. She's gonna, if there is, she's gonna ship you with that and probably me. <laughs> what a strange thing to want to do to a door master. War master, sorry. Door, <laughs> door master? Don't give him more ideas! <laughs> you know what, Derek? That's a good yeah. question. You know what? I'll go for the deluxe version because it's much more colorful. Yeah. I don't think they have wall monsters in uh, Link's Awakening, though. 
I know Minish Cap you... doesn't. I don't know about um, I don't know okay. about Link's Awakening. All right, well, yeah. um, I'm already playing uh Link's Awakening. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Link's Awakening made some progress. <laughs> 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 I never heard of that one. Like some <laughs> like, like an exclusive Zelda game, Legend of Zelda. <laughs> Legend of Zelda. La 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 la. la. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 wait, even gonna... better, even better. Legend of Greg. Oh. No! <laughs> what the hell? That's random Okay, fuck. there was a scene from, a there was a, a Game Grubs episode where they were playing uh, Sonic 06 back when John Trent used to be around. Oh, um, okay, uh, at, they finally defeated, uh, they finally defeated, uh, is Silver as Sonic, uh, which that's at the beginning part of the story mode. Um, oh. God. And Aaron, yeah, Aaron start it starts comparing uh and, and those uh those exp and those uh, and those exceeding moments like he meant he mentions a list like he goes like you play like a game like you yeah, got like a uh, Call of Duty God of War uh, the Legend of Greg like he stutters and then he just randomly says Greg out of nowhere he was gonna say Zelda but he said Greg just to... <laughs> <laughs> stream has been going on for a long enough. Yeah, I, I think I I've, I've, I think I've got enough said yeah. here. Ye we got enough good highlights for, for tonight. <laughs> yep. So. Yep. So most people are looking forward to Mario's play. missing a Tetris too, but I'm gonna keep Back to the Future in there just for the sake of filler. Yeah. <laughs> um. But yeah. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Thank you guys for sticking around. Uh. Dude, also, don't dude. forget to plug out the orange stream. <laughs> yeah, go ahead and yeah, check out Ellie. Really... Somebody already plugged that in. Uh, I'm gonna yeah, go ahead and copy the link to that. I know, but you know, uh, it is worth doing. It's worth overdoing, right? Uh, and stop comparing me to Lightning Bliss, for God's sake! Lightning Bliss doesn't have a dog. Yes. I will, I will convince Golden to make me a mod on his live streams, so that whenever I see people doing that, I can quickly put a stop to it. So beware. I have admin powers. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, um, as for any game next week, disregarding you know the the, the donation goals, um, I'll have to think about that over time. I think that would be. She something... has a Kieran OC. Yeah, I don't have a. I don't do have a oh. Pody OC. I have a uh, Kieran, Kieran instead. Oh yeah, uh, Fox. If you need my vectors, I have a stash folder of them. For sure. Them. Yeah. No, I, you definitely had some moments in there. Did I? <laughs> Send, did I send you the um, updated pictures for me? Probably. I don't know. I would have to look into that. Um, in the meantime, um, thank you guys for sticking around. <laughs> um, Logic mod. <laughs> Good one. Yeah, yeah, I sent you the link. All right. Uh, so I'll be catching you guys later. Um, I'll be streaming hopefully next Thursday. So. All right. So I have a bunch of pictures for that, so I might have to make some. I need to get some vectors for my daughter, so see, yep. she she needs to get some. She needs to get some. some There's clips so. now. Yep, there is. <laughs> yeah. So thank Got you guys for watching. Yeah. I'll catch you later. See, see ya. ya. Yeet.